Do you guys remember that video I did on the um, HyperX Ally Core or Alloy Core Origin, <laughs> whatever that was, that keyboard? Remember how I couldn't update the firmware? Well, apparently I'm not the only one that's had this problem, and I found the answer to how to fix it. It just takes a bit of downloading and forcing a download. So let me get, let me show you guys just so you know. Before we begin, don't forget to like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel. Also, link is down below to the merch store. Go get some great merch. So before we do this, um, I just need to say that we are going to have to um, force a couple things. Uh, it's not going to like what we're doing. This is just because from what I can tell, um, the fix isn't technically one that's entirely supported. However, it is also safe to do and currently the only way I know how to fix this. So, so first thing here, you have to use the link that's down below. Um, I am going to put it down there for this video. Uh, it's going to direct you to this, it's saying that it can't scan for viruses and this might harm your computer. Just, just press download anyways. It's 100% fine, don't worry about it. It's gonna download this little file right here. It is the HyperX Ally Origin. I'm gonna open that. And again, it's gonna say this, it's Windows trying to protect your PC, just press more info and then run it anyways. Now, you can see this has the Origins core from HyperX firmware updater. This is going to force a firmware update for your device. It'll be a firmware most likely before 2106. I don't exactly know what's going on. I just know that 2106 is the um, firmware version that you need to have on the HyperX for the HyperX specific app to be able to update the firmware to what is currently being used, which is 2108. This gets you to 2106. Press update, it'll fix every, it'll get it all nice and going and you're all set. And then you just go right over to the HyperX Ingenuity, which I think they should rename because it's not very Ingenuity when your own app doesn't really work with your products that well. And it'll prompt you to update and just go through the update. Well, everybody, hope this helps you. Hope this makes sure that you guys can use your great new HyperX keyboards, which honestly are really, really nice. Um, Thank you guys again for tuning in and have a good day.